everyone, it's PhD Simmer here and welcome back to The Sims 4 Eco Lifestyle and we are continuing where we left off in the last part. Kylie's just inviting over her dad and her sister for dinner um, because her mum has passed away at the end of the last episode which is really sad. A whole fam are feeling a little bit down about it so we're going to invite them over. She doesn't really get on with her sister that well but oh, do you... Do you wish you looked as happy as I do? Well, you have the power. Just send one simoleon to me. Don't delay. Happiness is just a simoleon away. Hang up. <laughs> We're not interested. Um, so Kylie's going to cook some dinner for everybody. Uh, Colby's just getting himself cleaned up. Uh, the girls are playing all the computer games and Jane's doing his homework. And get that in the sink. Get nice and tidy. Um, oh, and somebody's at the door. It's Grandpa. Oh, and for some reason, Agnes Crumplebottom. Oh no, I hope Grandpa's not moved in on, moved on already. So we're going to have uh, Joe come and let Grandpa in. So let's see, let's give him, let's have a deep conversation. And let's console about death. I think I saw that pop up. Yep, console about death. Sad times. Praise his loyalty. Be like, you were married for so long. That's so sad. She's like, it's going to be okay, Grandpa. Uh, I don't know why multiple goths decided to just chill in my house. <laughs> you weren't invited, my friend. <laughs> okay, weird. Um, and Kylie's made the dinner. So we're going to call everyone to the meal. Have a little family meal. So let's call to meal. She's sad. She wants to go to bed, but no. Let's have a family meal together. Did you do it? I don't know if she called to meal. Um, and you, Jaden. Oh, he's done his homework. Perfect. I don't know if Grandpa is coming in. Are you coming in? Oh, no, don't leave. The whole point of you coming over was to present concept to Sterling. Oh, I don't think he's going to really care right now. It's all about death. Come in for some food. Can we give a serving to an actual person? I don't know if we could do that. Uh, no. Remember to take care of your outdoor trash cans. You were charged zero pounds for this visit. Okay. He doesn't care. <laughs> Talk about feeling depressed. Oh, he's not interested right now. We're going to tell him about our promotion as well. Complain about our problems. Based on the feedback Kylie received, she can now go back to the diafter table and improve the concept. Oh, it's okay, Dad. Oh, I guess we're interviewing about utilities. It's not the time, but we'll do it for work. That's so bad. Right, okay. Well, hopefully he'll just wander in. Um, Can you go, Mortimer? Like, this is a... We're having a bit of a, uh, a sad family time right now so can you just go away thank you <laughs> maybe he'll send a little text to Rashida we'll send her just a, a normal text maybe not the time for flirting I don't know what's going on there right we also need to make a cake for the girls' birthday so it's 9 10 p.m so we'll have to age him up in the morning I think um let's see He's pretty much fine, so I'm just going to let him crack on. Let's actually see if there's anything we can make for the apartment. So, um, hmm. We could make a bookshelf. Oh, we could make a chair. Uh, I think, oh, let's make the fine wall decor, since that's a level 10 item. Can you make that? Make it in white. Kylie, once you finish sorting out all that gross trash, you can make a birthday cake. I should put the, do you know what I need? I need, I need a little gate here so they could, oh, I have a clothesline? I didn't even realise. <laughs> <laughs> I've been using the tumble dryer, which is so not eco-friendly. Uh, but if we get a little gate, then hopefully she can just walk through. Yes! Why did I not think of that sooner? <laughs> there we go. Right. <laughs> right, I'm going to get her to eat and go to bed. She did everything she had to do for work today, so that's good. And Colby's fabricated that, so I'm going to get him to make a chair now for the apartment. Uh, maybe a bookshelf, actually. Let's make that in... Oh, he needs to buy a... Shale white dye. She's got a school project to do, but I don't know if I can be bothered. Because <laughs> they're going to age up tomorrow. I need Kylie to make that cake before she goes to sleep, actually. So, let's see. Let's do one from Granny's Cookbooks, because they're all cute. Um, let's do desserts. And we'll make... I think it might be Harvest Fest tomorrow as well. We'll make a birthday cake. Alright, so I'm going to send her to bed, even though it's not. she's not that tired. It's just late. I'm going to send both the girls to bed. They keep having arguments, these two. And I'm going to have him make a chair. He doesn't fail the fabrication anymore, which is really cool. He's pretty good at it now. And Kylie's making the cake. Oh, Kylie reached cooking level nine. That's really good. And the cake is done. So let's add birthday candles. Should we make a separate cake for both of them? 
I guess we could. They could have a cake each. They've been twins their whole life sharing everything, so we'll make them a little cake each. Uh, we'll make a lemon blueberry cake. Okay, it's 6am and it is harvest fest, but we're also going to age up the girls. So let's get them. I don't know why I had them do their homework because it was pointless because they could age up. But anyway, good practice. So we're going to get her to get some leftovers and I'm going to have... Oh, actually, let's not do leftovers. Let's have you... Um, just going to do some stuff in the garden because I want her to make a... a what do we call it? A uh, grand breakfast for the fam. So let's do cook a grand meal. Let's do a grand breakfast. Yum, 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 yum. Oh, and the gnomes are here. Oh, he liked it. Yay. Can you get out of my way now? <laughs> Teleport here. Thank you. I wonder if we hear anything about our scholarships. Let's come and appease this gnome. Appease this gnome. I'm going to give him some pie. Give some pie. Oh, she's still got this bad sentiment. Who are you feeling bitter about? I'm going to remove all sentiments from her. Uh-oh, she upset the gnome. She upset it. Oopsie. <laughs> How's the breakfast going? I'm going to have her actually set the table with casual setting. Let's do yellow. Jaden, did you just eat? Dude, we're just about to have a grand breakfast. Your mum's been working in the kitchen hard for this. You know what we should serve for the with the grand breakfast? The honey fizz that I don't think anyone wants. Where is that honey fizz that we made? Oh, I don't even know. Oh, we got a gift. I think that must have been from Scout. Open. Oh, it's a little mouse toy. Cute. He's got so much crap in his inventory. Okay, the grand breakfast is ready. So let's come and um, sing together. <laughs> Um, Old Lang Syne, Jingle Bells, Happy Birthday. I don't know what that one is. Don't think anyone's joining you. I don't understand this either. I can't seem to grab a serving or quarter meal, which is really annoying. What's going on here? Oh no, look at the gnomes again. Ugh. Let's have Kylie come and appease the gnome. I'm going to give you salad because you're a bunny. Well, my plans to have a nice grand breakfast as a family went a bit wrong. <laughs> You're definitely working up an appetite out there. You gotta pay for college soon, girls. There we go. Right, cool. Oh, most food everywhere. This house is a nightmare. I'm gonna have them invite over their significant others. So we're gonna invite over Billy. And we're gonna have Monica invite over Jeb. And we're gonna have Jaden invite over Rashida. The greenest of thumbs, Kylie is flourishing as much as her crop of germinating plant friends. This budding emotion is surely a sign that she likes gardening. Yeah, sure. Okay, let's go and greet. Uh, here's Rashida. Oh god, who've destroyed the toilet? <laughs> gonna embrace her and let's come and greet. Oh, she looks cute in this outfit, Billy. We're gonna age those guys up as well. Oh god, are they going to school? Surely not. Surely it's a um, because it's harvest fest. It's a uh a day where we don't have to go. And Monica. Oh, Jeb's a young adult already. Right. We need to get this show on the road. <laughs> we need to get this birthday on the road. Uh, eat grand breakfast. Someone needs to clean that toilet. And why are you not wearing any pants, Billy? <laughs> okay. This toilet is disgusting. Let's come clean that. We've got visitors over. There we go. Nice job. Okay, right. Let's get this birthday going. So let's come and have Joe. Well, let them finish their interactions. Oh, they're so cute. Look, Monica, you, um, Kylie, you look cute in this outfit. We haven't seen her wear this one yet. Let's come over here and have a look. Oh, she changed her outfit. She's going outside. Oh, dear, oh dear. Wow, there's so much going on. It's crazy. Let's go and get the mail. What do we get in the mailbox? What's this? Scholarship letter result. Oh, uh, congratulations. Josephine won the scholarship for food and drink at £2,000. Congratulations. Josephine won the helping hand at £2,500. Um, she won the, yeah, okay. So she won those. And I think they must be her sisters then. Open, open. I think you can only open the ones that are yours. She won the super scout and she won the helping hand. Uh, sorry to inform Josephine that she has not been awarded the Building the Future Scholarships. Aww. Uh, she got the Athletics at 4,500. Crazy. She didn't get the Great Outdoors. She
she did not get the friend of the animals. I'll bet she's gutted about that one. Uh, she did not get the Evergreen Harbour one. That's a bit strange. Um, and she got the food and drink one. Oh, so she got quite a few. So I reckon they got quite a bit of money between them. I'd say at least about £6,000. Okay, what's she doing here? Have a recent performance job praised by... <laughs> okay, no. Let's go pee like a champion. And then we're going to actually get our birthday on the road. Blow out candles and... Here we go. Monica aged up. Young adulthood, lifelong responsibilities, virgin careers and vast horizons await. Whoever said their 20s aren't a blast. Okay, let's say. Animal enthusiast, not for Monica. Bookworm. Mm. No. Creative. I'm going to let her have creative and not glutton. Let's have creative and I would say maybe... I might give her active. Yeah. Joe aged up. She already was a cat lover. I might give her the animal enthusiast. I'm going to give her bookworm. She seems more like she was a bookworm. And I'm going to give her animal enthusiast. Yay! Monica is no longer in scouting. Monica's been removed from the Eco Friends Club because it no longer beats her requirements. Fair enough. Uh, and Grandpa sent a gift. Can we age up? Age up Sim. Yeah, I want to age up. No, I wanted to age up Billy. Is she not here? There she is. Let's be thankful. Invite her in. Let's see if we can age her up. Age up Sim. Billy, that's it. So is she now a young adult? It still says she's a teen. How weird. Oh, well, I'll do it through cheats. <laughs> Okay, we're back and I've aged her up, so that's good. So let's come and use the bathroom. Okay, I think I'm going to get the girls to start their university application. So let's do university application. More choices. Start university application. Let's go. And Joe's going to do hers. And Jaden, I gave him a load of parts, so I'm hoping... Oh, no. Uh-oh. <laughs> Oh no. Have him die for deals. He's going to take after his dad a bit. <laughs> okay, you, Monica's begun her university application. In order to complete application, both universities require an essay, an admissions interview, two letters of recommendation, and a high school transcript. Um, she should put together those application materials before reviewing and submitting a completed application. Okay. Um, we get a call from Jeb. Congratulations on your birthday. Thank you. So we're going to go for. Uh, request a letter of recommendation. We're going to start on our essay. University application. Get a letter of recommendation. Get the transcript. Just has a bit more to it, this mod. Guidance counsellor and... Then you can start on your essay. They're going to be busy bees for a while. Let's see if Jaden gets anything good out of the trash. Uh, what is Colby doing at the moment? He is... He needs to pee. And Kylie probably needs to actually have a nap. She had a stressful morning. <laughs> Josephine's teacher has received her recommendation request and will let her know when it's been sent. Nice. Looks like it's all in order. Okay, did you find anything? Oh, it's all empty. Right, try to clear the roaches and try to clear the flies. I think you could die from the flies if you're not careful. Oh, no. <laughs> Swatted from clearing or bonding with flies after being painfully rejected in the quest for kinship with a buzzing swarm. Maybe Jaden should be careful interacting with flies in the future. Only a few creatures can survive a nuclear apocalypse. These roaches easily spurn Jaden's futile attempt to send them the other way. Oh. Oopsie. I, I'm, I'm hoping he won't die because he's a teenager, but I don't actually know. Imagine if he died. Oh my god. Tragic. Okay, let's come and see if he can craft his bot thing that he was going to make. No, he still needs four more mechanisms. Oh, he needs loads of robot salvage parts. Wow, he needs loads of stuff. So let's come and craft. Oh, he needs loads of stuff. Okay, can we order stuff online? But the girls are kind of busy with the computers at the moment. Okay, we get a call. Dominic. Sorry to bother you, but I heard what generous person you are. No, I'm a, not doing that. <laughs> I've got to go to university. It's going to cost me a lot of money. Jojen's cut recommendation has been received. Nice, nice, nice. 
Yeah, I'm gonna get Kylie awake actually to play chess because she needs to get another logic skill for her job. To join that game. Oh, he's gonna go and ch chat with Kyoshi. Oh, we didn't decorate our house. Aww. Do we even have a decoration box? I don't think we do. Put some lights up. It's a bit late. <laughs> Put up decorations. Yeah, that's cute. That looks adorable. I can't believe we didn't, didn't bother doing that. Oopsie. And what's this one say? Thankful spirit. Uh, be thankful. He actually has a child's bike, I think. So we're going to sell his bike and get him an adult's bike. And then maybe he can go for a little cycle ride. I guess we could get him one of these eco lifestyle bikes. I'm not a big fan of them, to be honest. But I like the, the shape of them and stuff. But I guess we're playing the eco lifestyle let's play. So we're going to go do that. Oh, she's done an essay. Nice. Right, let's go for a little ride on our bike. Oh, it looks kind of cool. <laughs> okay, so she's having a little... She's tired from doing her essay, bless her. She's like, I'm exhausted. <laughs> Don't blame you, kid. You've been working hard on that. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, do leave a big thumbs up. Drop all your comment suggestion down below as always. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.